and welcome everyone to England's North West. The action soon to get underway here at Old Trafford. I'm Derek Ray and sitting alongside me, ready to provide all the technical and tactical analysis, is Stuart Robson. I'm very much looking forward to bringing you action from the Premier League. It's Manchester United versus Wolverhampton Wanderers. Well, thanks, Derek. The... Rashford! Brilliant save. The lineup for Manchester United. David De Gea between the posts. Victor Lindelof plays alongside Harry Maguire in central defence. Fred plays with Casemiro in the centre of the pitch. And up front for this game, it's Iago Aspas. Happy to pass the ball, but remaining patient. Well, looking at the table, a lot to like about Southampton's form, and it's more than just points, it's also about style. Well, Derek, I didn't expect them to be in a Champions League spot at this point of the season, but they deserve it at the moment. Their early season form has been really good. The coach is certainly getting the best out of the players. Now sending it in. And a fantastic diving save. <laughs> Can someone get on the end of this? Well, you can't really head them any better than that. But the goalkeeper was up to the task. Bruno Fernandes, Rashford, Fernandes, he's given it away, and the emphasis is on creativity. Oh, a vital interception. Well, for many, the focus of attention will be on Iago Aspas. Stuart, in your opinion, what might he deliver today? Well, Derek, when he's on form, when he's focused, he's a brilliant runner with the ball. He can take on players, he can go past people with ease, and he's got a great shot on him as well. I'm really looking forward to watching him play today. Mateus Nunes. So for Wolves, disappointment last time out. They lost in the game against Arsenal. How might this one go, Stuart? Well, to lose at home is never a good result. Obviously today, they must start with greater energy and make it more difficult for their opponents to dictate the flow of the game. But I'm not... In it goes! Well, the pressure has been mounting, and now they have the lead! Well, just look at this. It's a good finish and reward for their pressure. They really have controlled this game. One nil then. Number seven, Pedro Neto. Casemiro. Manchester United keep the ball. Advantage. Patience enough build up. Can they carve out a chance? And it might be. Well, a piece of quick thinking by the keeper. Well, that's great goalkeeping. He read it so well, didn't he? Well, you can tell what the fans think of that decision. They're certain it should have been a penalty. Lozano Gerdes. Superb block. He'll be delighted to have won the ball, having made that difficult challenge. Marcus Rashford. Good tackle. It'll be a throw. Very timely interception. Ryan Ait Nuri. Guehi. Mark Guehi. Well, possession is the watchword inside their own territory. Nuri. Neto. 
And options in the centre. Joel Linton. Still possibilities. And I think the threat has been averted. Well, I don't think they've been at it today. But maybe, just maybe, that great save will inspire them now. Fred. Well, at first glance, you would think a strong possibility of a red card. Let's see. And the early shower. This is going to be a real test of their metal. Well, it's a straight red, and rightly so. But how will they replace him? They've got to reorganise now. Well, he had a lot of ground to cover. Splendid save. Well, can they draw level here? The crowd certainly thinks so. Happy to take on the shot. Terrific block. And inching towards the break, Wolves with the advantage. Stuart, how about your thoughts? Well, it's been a tight game so far, but they've just had that little bit more quality on the ball, particularly in midfield. Oh, opportunity here, Stuart. Excellent block. And space here on the flank. Well, it was a promising avenue of attack, but the momentum has been halted, and you wouldn't be surprised to see the card handed out. And deep into the penalty area. Racing forward, trying to catch them out. A real opening now. And a goal to increase their advantage. It's a two-goal lead now. Well, here's the replay. Watch how he goes past his man with such ease, and it's just a change of pace. And once he gets onto it, he just smashes it past the keeper with great technique. What an emphatic finish that is. Two nil now, and back underway. Bruno Fernandes. Well, visionary passing. Strong hand on that one. Out of play. United throw in coming up. Marcus Rashford. Advantage Manchester United. So two minutes of stoppage time to be added on. And the free kick awarded to Manchester United. That's what you call defending from the front possibilities here. And the upshot of that is offside. Well, he needed to look elsewhere because the flag was always going to go up. So no more time left. That concludes the first half here at the Theatre of Dreams. Well, just off the boil, I think it's fair to conclude Iago Aspas in this game, Stuart. Yeah, he's been well marshalled so far, but he hasn't worked the defenders or the goalkeeper hard enough. He's got to impose himself on this game, otherwise they're going to struggle to get back into this. Away they go, into the second half, and Wolves dominating the proceedings. Will it be a different story this half? And space to cross it. Really vital interception. Anthony. It's a good Wolves move in the making. Can he finish? A smart stop here. Substitution time it is here. Yeah. 
delivering it. Goalkeeper getting in the way. Superb save. And first class defending cleared off the line. Neves. The end product just wasn't there. And don't forget, we have more Premier League action coming up for you on EA TV. It's Manchester United facing West Ham United. And scope for them to produce something exciting. Joel Linton able to get a body in the way. Anthony Rashford. Bruno Fernandes has it. Anthony Rashford being egged on by the crowd. Can he finish? And oh, it's in. We cannot declare this contest over. They still believe. Well, as you can see, he just about gets that right. Some would say it's slightly lucky. I would say it's perfect placement. So the match continues and United just one behind here. Room to roam for Wolves on the wing. It has to be. Couldn't grab hold of it. What an important piece of defending. Here's a change for Manchester United. Over it comes. And a struggle to get it away properly. Well, not making life difficult for the keeper at all. A wide attempt. Well, this is the home of live football, EA TV, and we have more action coming up from the Premier League for you. It's Wolverhampton Wanderers taking on Brighton. I'm really looking forward to that. Two entertaining teams in what should Now, be. hold on, Stuart, they're in here. Well, whatever way you slice it, a long, long way from the target, Stuart. Well, a lack of technique and composure there, that's a bad miss. And Wolves in a position of menace. Neves and the body in the way well let's see what they have in store for them on the break well let's send it over to Alex Scott shall we because someone has scored in the Arsenal game and in with a real chance The ball is running again at 2 all. Well, he's got past his man. Oh, a smart stop. And apologies to Alex for having to interrupt her. Just to confirm, West Ham did score in that match. And the lead at the moment is 2-0. Now he must favour the cross. He's blocked it. It's going to be United's free kick. And that is going to be a free kick. Gonzalo Kedge. That's a routine take. Oh, he's given the ball away. Neves. And he takes on the shot. And calling upon the goalkeeper to keep things even. Well, he's got to be pleased with that. He might just have got his team a draw here. Trying to deliver it accurately. Not all that convincing defensively. A oh, tremendous block. Well, smuggled behind for another corner. Oh, 
And the referee's verdict is penalty kick. Substitution for Manchester United. Coming off the pitch, number five, Harry Maguire. To be replaced Place to put them back in front. And in it goes, as coolly as you like. Never in any doubt from the spot. Well, here it is again, and just watch the keeper. He stands still, hoping it's hit down the middle. Unfortunately for him, he's got it wrong. What a big moment in the dying embers. Will it prove decisive here? Well, visionary passing. Well, the supporters think it's on. Mateus Nunes. Gonzalo Gersh now. He's going forward well here. Can he finish them off? Couldn't grab hold of it. And he could be in proper trouble here. Well, it looks so promising, but a goal kicked the outcome. Well, following on from the previous incident, he sees yellow now. Fernandes. Fred. They've got to be really mindful of the time situation, attacking though they might be. Under pressure, doesn't seem to be bothering him. Gaia. Determined defending. Plenty of support here. And let's give credit to the defending. This might be the perfect counter-attacking opportunity. Fred. Iago Aspas. Now well, ruled to have taken up an illegal position only just. This could finish it! And in all likelihood, that is game over. So little time left for a response. Well, let's look at this again. To pick out this pass shows wonderful vision. It's inch perfect. And when he gets onto it, he decides to go for power. It's a really emphatic finish, which gives the keeper no chance. So full time, it is done and dusted here and three points for Wolverhampton Wanderers. What did you think of their overall display? Well, Derek, it was fairly comfortable in the end because they were tactically superior, had better individuals and were always a threat going forward. It was a really good performance and a good result as well. well one man who was very difficult to contain out there, Gonzalo Gage. Sum up what you saw from him. Well, it's a good performance. He worked hard, played well and scored a goal. And his team won. What more could you ask for?